than choose. Truth or glory. Stand, Leofrid. Live to fight another day. What? Your loyalty to Burkrit is not a loyalty returned. He resigned the crown and fled to Rome. He's gone. You lie. Lie to a man seconds from death? What would I gain? He saved himself and left you to die. All this fighting, it's for nothing. For no one. To betray one so trusted. So close. It's a dishonor worth a thousand deaths. Eivor, you have shown me a great kindness. It, it is only fitting that I do the same. At Venonis, there is a statue with a scroll laid in a small bowl. You must burn it. A scroll? Your name is on this scroll. At Burgred's request, I put it there. When it is found, the zealots who read it will hunt you. Who are they? It doesn't matter now. You haven't much time. Burn the scroll, or they will never stop hunting you. Where will you go now? Rome. Come on. Let's take you back. Back there with Leofrith. Back there with Leofrith. I didn't think you'd spare him. There's no honor in killing a man misled. He believed his king would die fighting for Mercia. He knows the truth now. And with that truth, he forges a new path. You were right about him, Tilbert. And right to believe the line that divides us can be thinner than it seems. Done. Nothing but smoke and ashes now. That should get those sellers off my back. You fought well, Leofred. With honor. You will go to your guard as you are now. I am ready. We Norse have a name for men and women with courage like yours. Drenge. I name you one now. He didn't deserve this. He chose this. Come. We should get back. Back there with Leofred. Why did you see it fit to kill him? Leofrid was a fighter who knew the cost of war. He died defending an idea he believed in, true or not. There's some honor in that. I... I think I understand. Now, now it seems the wind calls me back to Randvi. Let's tell her the good news.